Some of you might remember our Revenge Little Rock 5 5 watt all tube head from a few years ago. Well the company that was manufacturing them for us quit making them. They wouldn't supply us any longer. So we sold the last one oh, a year or so ago and we've been kind of out of that amp business on these little 5 waters ever since. But here's your opportunity to build your own even if you don't have great solder skills. The Little Rock was based on a Fender Princeton 5F2 tweed circuit with a few changes. One 6L6 power tube. You can also put in an EL34 if that is what you'd prefer. But it's got a toroid transformer, a 5 watt 3 watt switch, 4 ohm and 8 ohm outputs, if you want to wire in a direct out, you can do that. Power switch, standby switch, LED lights, volume tone, gain, and a high gain input and a low gain input. So it's got a lot of features and it was a great little amp, which is why they sold so well for us. But as I said, now you can build your own. Here are all the parts you get in our kit to build your own 5 watt Little Rock all tube head. Everything you see here comes in the kit including the power outlet, a toroid transformer, a 4 and 8 ohm output transformer, a fully populated board. You don't have to do any soldering on this board. There are a few plug-ins but the plug-ins come pre-wired to the power switch, the half power switch, LEDs, but pretty much everything you need here sort of knobs because you might want to choose your own after your install and tubes you'll need a 6L6 or an EL34 and 112AX7 but this kit comes almost entirely complete you can see on the back of the board that it's a well assembled product ceramic tube sockets and it even includes the little screws for the standoffs for mounting this on your chassis Here's an example of one we built using a $20 Fender Frontman 15. We bought the amp from a local Goodwill store and gutted it and installed all of those components into its chassis and its cabinet. All it takes is a little imagination. You can see our tubes hanging down there inside the chassis after we built this amp. We even used their outlet that was still in the chassis. Half power switch, 4 and 8 ohm outs. We built it like this so we can run this little 5 watt through a 112 cab and it really sounds good. So there you go. We provide all the hard parts and instructions on how to assemble it. You provide a cabinet and a chassis and you can recycle some old solid state amp into a great little 5 watt all tube amp. So we'll have this kit up on our website soon. In the meantime, shoot us an email at the address scrolling across the bottom of the screen. Build your own amp. Recycle some worthless old solid state amp into a 5 watt tube screamer.